We're at a fake Banksy exhibition, and this is our honest review. This is more art than this. <laughs> and there's more. So me and my friend are tourists in a foreign city, and we walk past a gallery where we see a famous name on the wall, Banksy, an artist that we know and we love. So we're like, this is awesome. He happens to have an exhibition when we're visiting the town. Let's go check it out. We buy tickets, we walk around, we're super happy. We're like, that was awesome. And then we get home and check out Banksy's Instagram where it says, hey guys, this exhibition is totally not related to me. They just sort of stole my name and put it all over the exhibition. I have nothing to do with it. So then we get back home and guess what? A Banksy exhibition showed up in our town as well. So let's go check it out and give you an honest review. <laughs> Wasting our money twice. <laughs> We're only in the beginning of the world of Banksy exhibition, and I can already tell you that everything that is not related or associated with Banksy is kind of interesting here. Everything that's pretending to be Banksy, not really. JPEG downloaded from the internet, JPEG downloaded from the internet, JPEG downloaded from the internet, not really interesting. What is interesting, or what I want to know, is what's downstairs in the basement of this old church. Unfortunately, you cannot go there. So more JPEGs. Is this a random placement of a trash can and a fire extinguisher? Or is it art? Well, this is more art than this. We bought tickets for this exhibition on Groupon, where else? And one of the negative comments we read there is that the art repeats here, that you can see multiple pieces again. And we noticed that as well. We've seen this already. I read somewhere online that some of the pieces here are originals. They would be worth millions of dollars, so obviously I was looking for them where they are, and I finally found them. They're hiding here. <laughs> obviously you're not gonna display originals, you're gonna uh, hide them in a vault. <laughs> There's some really smart text here, I've learned blah blah blah, but what I've learned just now, and I didn't know, is that Banksy actually did create some stuff in Czech. Impressive. You want to see the most important art piece in a gallery and you don't really understand art? Here's my tip on how to find it. Look at the security cameras, the way they are pointed to which art piece, that is the one that is important. And that would be this one in this case because that's where the camera is aiming. Vancouver-based street artist whose work is similar to the iconic Banksy. Oh, it's not Banksy. And apparently this guy doesn't even have a name. It's just a guy who does something similar to Banksy from Vancouver. Poor guy. But guarded by the camera. Oh no, there's more. Why can't they put an escalator here? I guess we don't need to point out again that everything here is a fake replica, but we did find an original piece of art. It's this traffic sign uh, from Prague. So if the city of Prague is missing a traffic sign, you'll find it right here. Not only one, there's another one over there. For a split second after visiting the restroom, I hoped I finally found an original art uh, piece, which is this one. But then, after taking a closer look at this beautiful picture, I noticed the watermarks all over it, so yet another thing downloaded from the internet and printed out. And as one would expect from a Banksy exhibition, you exit through the gift shop. And in the gift shop, you can buy various interesting items. For example, a mouse pad. Go figure. What is Banksyho knížku nějakou? Máme knížku tam. A jako Banksyho vyloženě jako. Tohle vlastně tady máte ty díl, co jsou tady ukázané. To chápu, ale nějakou knížku jako Banksyho, jako která je Banksy. Ne, tak to mám bohužel. To jsou jenom prostě tady tyhle ty všechny jako to. Jo, jo. A z toho budou nějaký peníze Banksymu nebo ne? Jo, tak to asi nejsem nejsem. Jste si jistý. Jenom takhle prostě všechno, co má napsané na sobě Banksy, ale není to Banksy jasný. In a normal gallery, once you finish admiring the art pieces, you can buy their copies in the gift shop, a cheap replica's posters. Not here. In the gift shop, you can buy the identical thing that you saw here on display. It's the same thing. There's also a guest book where people can write their opinions on the exhibition, and even Banksy himself wrote something. Glad you all came and liked my work. All the best, Banksy which makes this page worth probably a million dollars. Uh, there's also an opinion from one of the visitors. This place is a joke and it's not funny. <laughs> it's actually pretty funny.
Let me be honest here, once we entered this place and we pulled out our camera, the people who run the show here, they showed up and they said, we know you guys, film whatever you want and say whatever you want, which is what we usually do, but thanks for that. Uh, them knowing we're probably not gonna say the most positive stuff about this place and we might uh, be honest. Seeing the people, the tourists that come here and they see the Banksy sign on an old church, obviously they love it. Banksy, in a way, and I'm sorry to say that, is easy to understand art. It's that kind of, you know, oh, that's the graffiti I like. I don't like the bad graffiti. This is the good graffiti. So yeah, people like it. They take pictures, it's recognizable. So I understand people leave this place happy. How was the exhibition? Yeah, it was good. Okay. It was good? Yeah. Very interesting. Uh -huh. uh, where are you from? Belfast. Belfast. And I see you're uh, carrying an original piece of art from yeah. Banksy. Yeah. <laughs> Is it any different from the ones you were looking at on the walls? No, no, it's not, not the same. It's the same? Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. <laughs> Would you recommend it to uh, people Definitely, to visit? Yeah. Yeah? yeah, I feel like art. Feel like art? Yeah. Okay. It's interesting. I didn't realize there was so much behind every piece. Lovely, lovely. All right, enjoy your visit to Prague. Bye-bye. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. See, I told you people would love it. I'm the only person who didn't like it. I'm definitely not gonna recommend this place to visit, nor tell you not to visit. I mean, the space is quite interesting, let's be honest here. But there's so much street art in Prague, anywhere on the streets, even on Old Town Square. Once you're staring at that clock, there is street art literally around the corner. That is super cool. Do you wanna hear about that on the future episodes? Let us know, because usually when we make art-related episodes, nobody really watches them. So I'm curious if there's a lot of comments uh, below, we will make an art episode. And I understand this one is being watched a lot, fortune telling, because it's Banksy related, <laughs> even though it's not. <laughs> Now everyone's looking at me thinking like, oh, he's sitting in the Banksy chair. He shouldn't. <laughs> you just asked if, uh, if it's real. He said it could be. He said? If it's a painting, it, it could be. Uh -huh. uh -huh. uh -huh. could be. Že něco by mohlo být. Že projekty jako obrazek normálně jako zárámečkovaný, takže projekty některé jsou originální. A který? To, to se neví kvůli neví. jako security. Prostě. Kvůli security. A, a security jste tady vy? Prostě mezi tím tam, tam že se někdo Jestli. jako na ně pozor nedává. Že? Nikdo na ně pozor nedává a je tam originální dílo Banksyho? No, no. <laughs> no právě proto. <laughs> this was our honest review of partially dishonest Banksy show. By the way, fake flower. And in the end, I'm going to teach you how to say unauthorized in Czech. It's neautorizovaný. Neautorizovaný is unauthorized.